This unboxing video is for the Creek Cooler Pup. I saw the website uh, about a year ago after their Kickstarter campaign had stopped and I contacted them to find out they were still gonna make it and they said they were, so I finally got the chance to order it. The box is already open. I started this video, but there was some neighborhood noise going on, so I started over, but uh, here we go. I got up through VM Innovations through Google Express. Uh, got it pretty quick, ordered it on Sunday night, and got it Tuesday morning, uh, paid $79.99 after a 20% off coupon that they had. Uh, there you go. Most of the videos you see online are just promotional videos and they only have the uh, prototype that the Creek Cooler made. So it's actually nice to kind of get your hands on one of them. So it's got the nice molded in handles. Uh, looks like a divot there for maybe a carabine or something like that. Uh, information here, 15 quart, uh, two cup or a koozie holders looking on deck. I I've seen reviews where they say the cups or cans don't fit there. That's because you need to put your koozie in there first. Quick connect lid, dual wall blown mold construction, foam insulation, 24 hour ice retention, uh, great for dry storage, and a mini flag holder. And oh, there it is, just like on the big one, we got a mini flag holder. So the lid, uh, it's easy to pop right off, it's a screw on lid. The box came, it was already, looks like the box is falling apart, but uh, yeah, that seems to go on pretty good. And uh, pretty sturdy, I guess if you use the whole weight, it's gonna pop off like that. But uh, yeah, it seems to be pretty good. Uh, it's not just going to fall out. Uh, it's got a little rope to connect it to more information inside. Uh, the wall seemed pretty thick on it. Uh, I think I read this one and a half inch. And uh, it's got a pretty amount of decent space inside for drinks and lunch and stuff like that. I did want to measure. One thing that was hard for me to find were actual measurements of it. So I did want to bring a tape measure out and it's uh, about 20 and a half to 29 inches and uh, about 15 inches across. So you got some pretty good space. I think seven and a half, eight inches deep. So on the exterior, you have the inside. The inside, you got about five and a half inches from the bottom uh, floor to the bottom of the roof. So there you go, Creek Cooler, Creek Cooler Pup. I did want to add that after I stopped the video, I, I double checked the lid and I definitely did not have it down tight enough. Uh, after I tightened the lid down, I can't really do it now because I already put away the tripod, but uh, you know, that lid is on there pretty good. Uh, I mean, I didn't crank it, crank it on there either. I mean, I just put it on there. There's a couple of arrows that line up here, an arrow here and an arrow there. You line them up, you twist it on. And uh, like I said, I mean, I had a you know, you put it against your body, twist a little bit, it goes on pretty good uh, without having to crank it down really tight, but uh, that lid does stay on there pretty good.